2016 NJASCD Dr. Ernest L. Boyer Outstanding Educator Award winner is Eloise Forster. Ellie Forster has served the educational community in New Jersey in many important capacities, including a five-year stint as assistant superintendent in Jersey City, implementing the first state takeover of a local school district in the nation's history. In 2002, she joined the staff at FEA as director of school leadership programs, where she created New Jersey XL, a non-traditional principal certification program to address the crisis of a shortage of certified principals. Its inception had to do with the, re the fact that there were many people not pursuing principal certification because they just didn't want to go back for a non -tr you know, to a traditional program. We wanted it to be rigorous. We wanted it to be something that was going to be um, beneficial to the to participants and so forth. The program was designed so that there'd be a lot of active engagement on the part of the participants. Uh, there would be uh, practical and relevant material that they could relate to to their day-to-day -day functioning in their jobs. Frank Palatucci, Adele McCullough, and Jeff Graber have worked with Ellie for many years and now run the XL program for FEA. They say that Ellie's attention to detail and focus on creating a sustainable program of excellence and relevance are the main reasons why XL and FEA's mentoring program, Leaders to Leaders, are flourishing today. One quality Ellie has, I think, mm. is vision. It's not until you begin to peel back the onion of what she did and try to figure it out and look at it and then all of a sudden have this epiphany that, oh wow, there it is, there's the connections. It's amazing. Uh, at last look, uh, better than 1,600 people have gone through the program. The numbers are really, really strong and uh, you know, we're very pleased with the success of our, of our candidates mm -hmm. and their career path. It's very, um, it's very rewarding you know, to see how the program has grown, how it's ex you know, expanded in so many ways. Uh, but mostly the caliber, the quality of the, of the people that are coming. I mean, the, I really feel the program has achieved what the original goal was. And the original goal was not about how many people can we put through this program. It was really about the quality of uh, the leadership that was going to be the result of their going through a program like this. And that's what makes me feel best because I know it's making an impact out there. Having been in a district with the responsibility of hiring a good deal of administrators, there certainly is a difference between an XL candidate and someone who comes from someplace else. What Ellie put together again in, in uh, 03, uh, and again, I, I don't say this without even thinking twice, this work of genius, uh, putting together as a cohort model from the very mm -hmm. beginning, which is also much different than the normal experience at a, at a, in higher ed. Uh, these, these people go together uh, and work, work through the program together as partners. So when they land jobs, they have this network of people that they know. Uh, we incorporated an action research project, which actually made them focus. They had to identify a problem in their school, uh, collect data, identify possible solutions and then actually plan for what those solutions might be. 72 percent of the projects that were completed through Excel are currently in place being used in a district. However, as students were graduating from Excel and starting their careers as administrators, they reported that poor mentoring was an issue that had to be addressed. And I suggested that, you know, maybe there, this might be an opportunity um, for um, FEA and JPSA and FEA to step up to the plate and perhaps provide the mentoring across the state. They had to be focused on the goals of the school and thinking like leaders. It was really about putting them in the shoes without them necessarily, you know, being in the shoes. Fortunately, I have to say, I mean, most of the people that wanted to mentor were eager, dedicated, and um, were very good. It's clear that Ellie has indeed left her mark on FEA and on educational leadership in New Jersey. She values uh, people's opinions and um, she's always willing to roll up her sleeves oh, sorry. And, and, get the, and, get the, and, and work with you. And the work prevails because even though Ellie has left the program a few years ago, the work is still, still there, there and it's still being able to be used daily. Uh, you know, I think most of us in education, we talk about uh, we want to make a difference. And I think the award has kind of made me feel, believe that I have.